hello everyone welcome to this uh, video today uh, i am going to show you how can we reschedule our Snow snowflake uh, certification exam so uh, today my snowflake data engineering professional exam is scheduled but i am facing some system issue and uh, i guess due to this system issue i will not be able to launch my exam at uh, you know uh, uh, on time so I may miss out my schedule exam and then I will uh, you know lose out uh, approximately $440 of the exam fee so today I will try to reschedule my exam uh, I will push it uh, by an hour so that I can fix my system issue so first thing is like you know I will take you to the snowflake uh, web ex uh, webser uh, certification exam console so I will search for uh, snowflake web assessor, web assessor and uh, here uh, this will redirect me to the snowflake uh, certification portal I will log in here uh, with my user ID and password okay and when I log in when I go to my assessments in this uh, assessments you can see that I have a scheduled exam at uh, 12 p.m. this noon and uh, I have an option of uh, reschedule or cancel right uh, and some of my past completed exams that you can see here so uh, I will click on reschedule and I will confirm the residual option. Now it is asking me to select the date and time. So I'm ready for exam today, but uh, I want to push it by an hour or so, so that I can get time to fix my system. So I will say 1 p.m. and uh, confirm the uh, acknowledgement and click on select. Now it is asking for the billing information because as per the policy, if we are rescheduling our exam within 24 hours, uh, we'll have to pay around $59. So uh, this, could, this could be an additional uh, loss to me. Uh, and uh, I will now check out the help section of Snowflake so that if I, if I could get some support from uh, 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 the team uh, in pushing uh, this exam for an hour that would be of great help so I will go to the help section if you see here and uh, it will open this standard help um, page that this web assessor has uh, put together and in this I see an option of chat so I will click on chat it will open a new window criteria new window and uh, here if you see we have an option of uh, submitting a form we can raise a support ticket and uh, also there is an option of chat with uh, chat with an you know expert so chat with an expert is something that you will find at the bottom uh, of uh, right hand side top cor and, uh, bottom corner you will find an option of chat with an expert so click on that and here it will load the chat window so you just need to fill in your first name last name and your uh, you know email id and then you can basically start the chatting it will connect you to the support team and here we have uh, Shelby uh, who would be supporting me in this uh, issue so I will uh, I will say that I will request for a rescheduling so I will say hi Shelby could you please help me uh, push this uh, exam by an hour as my system configuration uh, is not yet ready 
Now, she may ask me for the email ID, registered email ID. So instead of sharing my email ID, I may, uh, uh, you know, pass my username. I'm passing my username to see if she can fetch the details with my username. If the username does not work, I will have to provide my email ID. I'm waiting for a response. By the time I get the response, I will pause this video. For the exam that I'm taking today, so I will confirm my exam name that is Snowflake Data Engineering uh, Professional. Okay, so she's asking for the exact issue that I'm facing in the system. Uh, so, as you know, that we uh, need to install the Sentinel application on our laptop if we are taking this exam virtually and that is where I am facing issue so I will say I am getting issue with Sentinel application that I'm facing is uh, related to installation my system compatibility is causing the issue I need to update my system okay Okay, so typically they don't ask these many questions, but looks like she is more curious to know my issue. So she's asking more questions, right? So um, I'm I'm using my operating system, which is Mac. I will say Mac OS. Okay, so as per my discussion with support team, uh, the version currently uh, I'm using of of this Mac, right, which is 11.4 is not compatible with the sentinel and that's where uh, you know this uh, has been confirmed with the chat and uh, she is now suggesting me to arrange some other laptop so that i can continue with the exam i requested to reschedule the exam and uh, uh, you know uh, uh, so that i can arrange some other laptop alternate laptop and i can continue with this exam right so this is a great help from support team they are very helpful in uh, supporting uh, the candidates and uh, you know resolving the technical issues so if you look at the queries right she was also trying to help me to resolve the queries if you know uh, it could be done at this system only uh, now uh, she is confirming that uh, you know she is uh, going to uh, reschedule my exam for to for today itself I'm, I'm i have just requested to push it by an hour so that i can arrange another laptop um and uh, hopefully it will be now uh, done right so this is just one example where uh, i am requesting for uh, rescheduling my exam but i have heard that many people uh, face uh, network issue or uh, power issue or something happened at home emergency right they miss out the exam and they pay additional uh, fee in you know uh, rescheduling the exam so all of these really put the burden on the candidates because they already go go, go through the uh, uh, exam preparation pressure and all. So I thought of putting this video 
so that you all can you know get to know the easy option of connecting with the criterion uh, support team and get the help immediately because if you go through the normal channel of the email right it may take 44 48 hours to get the response because they are heavily uh, uh, they are heavily loaded with the support tickets and with the limited support team they are doing their best to support but that takes time right so uh, you can follow the same uh, uh, approach which I have just uh, uh, you know uh, used and that way you should be able to uh, get the help uh, to reschedule this exam right uh, even in, in case of some of the personal emergencies that you have may have you can uh, reach out to support team through this channel and you can you know actually get the help uh, because if you go for the rescheduling there is another fee, additional fee and if we really have the genuine reason right uh, this fee is not really needed uh, through this channel right so i'm happy to share such uh, uh, you know tips and uh, videos so that it helps the uh, larger community Thank you so much i will come up uh, with another video which may help you and i will also share my experience of this exam in uh, the coming videos so for that you can subscribe this channel and you can get the notification whenever i'm posting new videos right thank you so much see you in the next uh, session bye